another Pikachu here with a Bakugan unboxing. This just came in about 10-15 minutes ago. So, crack it over my mark, really gonna say anything until I open it. I know what it is though, so I will take it off screen to open it because I am using knives and I don't really want to have a knife open on my channel. So, let's get this new pack, let's get this new product open. really excited about this one. This is going to be a short unboxing plus then a small PSA because to say what happened for last week, this past Thursday, Wednesday's video. So it is the new Bakugan clip, one of them. This is the Pyrus Darkus that comes with the Dark Pyrus Darkus Garganoid weapon. So actually kind of happy to have it, see this because it was ordered the other day and just came in, so I'm just gonna rip into it. I did not expect this to be as big as it is. I thought it was a little bit smaller. Granted, with the new Bakugan being as big as they are, I should have expected it to be a decently good, decent size. So let's hope we get the card out without damaging it or bending it. I think I got it. I probably bent the card. So, this is Pyrus Darkness, Gargonoid Webum's character card. It's from Shields of Astroa. It's a double flaming fist Bakugan. Its base is Pyrus. It's a 500B, 2 damage rating, and when it's holding a flaming fist, plus 300B power, and when it, you can pay 5 to fuse it. Its fuse side is Pyrus Darkness, of course. 900 B power, 8 damage rating, and plus 600 B when it's holding a flaming fist. So, that's the card. Just kind of throw in the trash into the box that came in. So, this is new. I've not picked one up with these yet. So, I need my knife again, because I want to open the box again, of course. So, I would prefer the Pyrus Orlis one that has been found in Australia, because me being a Pyrus Orlis brawler, as you can see, Cyndius, Kalion, Gar Gilator, Drago, and Feral. I don't have Auxilator yet. I do have an Orlis Trino Core, as you guys have seen, and an Orlis Pyravian Ultra. But you know me not finding all. I cannot find Orlis Gorin or Orlis Auxilator, which are the other two Orlis mains, which I think I'd just do with Auxilator as my other, my sixth partner, technically. Alright, got the cores out. So, ooh, a new Baka core. Actually, I think both these are new for me. So it's both Flaming Fists. The first one is plus five damage reading. And the other one is plus three damage, and when it's, when it's attached to a fusion Bakugan, or fused, plus four damage. Reading those off. And here is the Bakugan. I have not opened it yet, so let's move my knife out of the way. Let's put the clip up the top. Let's get a gate trainer, or two, four. I prefer to set up four just to be safe. And we'll roll it. Just need to find its magnet. Double check to make sure it's on the Yep, it's on the camera. Three, two, one, brawl. Oh no, my headphones. Oh, it opened. Oh, it does have little arms. Huh. It's pretty funny. It's cute. It's got manual arms. Yeah, this is Garganoid Webum. Sorry for the a little bit of a different quality today. I don't know if it, how bad the quality is going to be or different. I'm a little bit closer to my camera today because I'm in a small setup. As you can see, my computer. I'm at my desk, my computer desk, which I normally don't have on camera. The computer in general on camera. So I'm going to quickly close this up and kind of get into a small PSA on what's going to or what's going on with my channel lately. So clean up this, and this, I will have my face, and I do kind of need to be serious. I am a little serious on this one. Oh yeah, wait, I should probably go over the clip. So, 
the giant clip, I thought it was going to be bigger. So, clips on like this, I think. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It goes like this. I wish this was a little bit smaller. It is huge. Like, like, alright, let me grab my tape measure. That's under my desk. Well, got nothing. Hope to... Hope to hell that it doesn't... So I'll put it at one foot. This is a tape measure, right? From the top to the bottom. It's like... From the top to bottom, it is about nine inches. Like, I, I, I did not expect it to be... Like, that's just how long it is. I didn't expect it to be that long. Just put the tape measure on my side for a moment. Put this off to the side. And then we're going to move the camera and change the camera. Can I not? Oh, I can't change the camera view. Okay. So, let's see if I can get this right. It's hanging out in front of my face. Well, let's go. You guys can see me. So, this past Wednesday, I had a video all recorded. I went to Maine from where I live. It's a couple hour drive. I went with some people, like, because they were doing something different. I went with them because I need, st I want to see my friend Nathaniel. So, we had unboxed the Pyrus Cycloid, which you guys haven't seen. Vent my Ventus Fade Ninja that I have now, as well, both core packs that I picked up at Walmart. Then we unboxed, which is really excited to do, the Shields of Astroia, um, Darkest. Ventus Chaos deck that had Maximus e or Enoch, Ventus Chaos Pegatrix Skeletor, and Pyrus ha Chaos Pyrus Sculptor Apollyon. Now, what had happened with the video is it didn't upload. I did not bring my iPad, which is my normal uh, recording device, so we couldn't get it done. I am really sad to see that I couldn't get a really cool video that, I, like, in my personal preference a cool video and I had a small PSA at the end which I will put at the end of this one so current which I'm gonna actually get into now so video didn't upload sucks but can't help anything about it so from now on I will be wearing a mask in my videos when I'm with friends I know a lot of my a lot of the youtubers I'm working with re recently are my friends from school or anywhere currently I feel like I should be wearing a mask I'm still See, because my parents are high risk, I don't want to risk anything. So, and just to show that I care, I will be wearing a mask in my videos. I'm making it optional, depending on who's with me. If I have Ninja Gamer, Zekatron Gaming, and Games Life, it's optional for them. Because, I don't know if anyone knows or watches them as well as watching me, but they are siblings, so they kind of don't have to wear a mask around each other all the time. Now, with my friend Nathaniel, from now on, if I record with him, or my friend Colin, which you guys haven't met, seen yet, you haven't seen Nathaniel either, now, because I will have them wear masks. It really depends on how I feel, because COVID, it's turning into the fall season, It's gonna, and viruses do, stri do better in the, in the winter, or in the cold, so to avoid any risks, I have to do this. I don't like wearing a mask, no one really does. I feel bad for the people that have to wear a mask all day long, including one of my siblings. So, for now on, I will be wearing a mask, and then and other people will be too. And then getting into a little bit more of the future uploads, Fridays won't have any, won't have uploads. I have not been consistent on uploading, only on Mondays. I've been trying to stay consistent on Wednesdays. Wednesdays. This is a Wednesday video here. I'm really sad to see that I could not get last Wednesday's video out, and I'm very sorry that I can't get stuff rolling. It's just very hard with COVID-19 still up, and there's a lot to do. But there's a lot around. Like, we have flu season coming out, which really is going to hurt, because now I have to be careful. And with that... So more future uploads. Tournament game tournament one is starting to shape up decently well. Ninja Gamer is helping me with up with editing a bit. I have to teach him a little I'm teaching him how to up edit with my software. But game three is going to be up to on 
is will be up by the time this comes out. Game 4 will come up the following Monday. Games, there's going to be 5 or 6 games. I don't know about the 6th. I know Game 5 is going to be the finals, which is me... Actually, I don't want to leave any spoilers. I'll just say that I'm in the finals. I did make it back this... Because we are doing a six-person bracket, I can kind of, I'll, I'll like, I'll put in, like right here. It will be a small cut for three seconds, like now. So, you guys have seen the bracket. It is like the base bracket from the past video, which would be bracket number three. I have my computer and I have everything on the side. So bracket number three, I believe, is the most recent bracket. And for the tournament, or it's going to be bracket four. Three or four, I don't know yet. I'll, I'll have everything sorted out by the time this comes out. But tournament number two will be either the start of October, or the, near the end of October, sorry. Because it's already almost October by the time this comes out. Actually, it will be... Today's the 27th. I'm recording this on the 27th, I'm trying to think. Um... 29 30th. It'll be almost October. So the end of into the the end of October, or oops, sorry about my hand being there. It'll be the end of October, or the during Thanksgiving I will have recorded everything. So during Thanksgiving, I will not be uploading videos. I will have most likely if you guys see a video, great, good job. It's great for you. Double checking the camera because my iPad does not like to be nice sometimes. So tournament two will feature some new people. There will be it will be an eight person bracket. The la the last game in the first full bracket. So after games one through three, all three losers will be playing a multiplayer game. Now this will be new for my channel because multiplayer games aren't played often in Bak in the Bakugan TCG. Now I don't know how it's going to work yet, but it's I'm going to be fighting n my friend Nathaniel in game 3. The only reason I'm doing a multi-game is so that all three losers of tournament bracket or bracket 1 will have a chance to continue. I will be making a new bracket with the help of Ninja Gamer. Um, my support for recording Games Life, which I'm kind of designating everyone what they help me with. Games Life helps me with recording. And I'm doing most of the background stuff anyway, so like, he's helping with recording. So that's gonna get done. Gotta get done. Or that's gonna be part of some fu future vids. Like, he's gonna be recording. I'm most likely gonna be judging the games. My friends entrust me to judge games. I am really happy, and I'm really happy as well for people who comment that and help out with what I mess up. So right now, I currently don't have anything planned coming up for the future besides maybe doing a uh, Pokemon Emerald Ruby Sapphire Fire Red Leaf Green one well one of the games I can get an emulator for for a computer and the audio will be off a bit because I have to cut and paste the audio from because I'll be recording the audio from my iPad because my computer has no mic which is really gonna hurt as well um so let me guys let you get let me know what you guys think about the uh, playthrough of pokemon emeralds maybe i'm not gonna do a nuzlocke i thought about it for a couple days i'm like maybe i could do a nuzlocke but i'm realizing no it's gonna be a lot harder because my computer is very hard to record on or not record per se well it's not record in general um it's hard to work with because it keeps it does crash from time to time and then in the future, if I can ever make money off of this, because it will go back into the channel and help more. Because any any help I can get for this channel would be tremendous. Because I already have five amazing friends that are helping me with my confidence and play, and playing out planning out videos for Mondays, which are going to be tournaments from now on. Once I have everything set up, I will have continuous uploads for each week with Mondays for tournament games because I feel like the tournaments are going to do a little bit better especially for when um not even especially for what just in general I just feel like it'd be better then in the future I would love to do a 
kind of a tutorial video on how to play, because it's not really easy to learn, but that's going to be a very long video, and I'm going to need a different recording device, because mine will not be able to do it. It'll be a full-length video, probably about 45 to an minutes to an hour. If I'm lucky, I might be able to get an hour and a half off of it, but I feel like that would be fun as kind of a video to teach people, oh, this is how this game is played, and this is what these terms mean. Because I talk in these videos like, people, my, my friend group knows what I'm talking about, because we all play to Magic. I stopped, current. I currently am not playing Magic the Gathering. I was a good player, like a really like adamant player. I loved playing the game, but now I'm not so sure, because it's some some just problems have come up, like a little bit of, not really medical, but I get headaches whenever I play now, and Bakugan's so quick, it doesn't have a chance to form. And you can, guys can kind of see how passionate I get with Bakugan, it's really fun. And if you haven't noticed, I'm using Dragonoid from last year uh, as one of my partners. Yeah, my new one from this year is a little messed up there. But, I feel like I'm taking a good step with starting this channel. I like it. And, my, I have family and friends supporting me with this. It's really good to know that. And, with everything, having COVID-19 around, it is a lot harder to record, as I've said before. Or even just get video ideas or hang out with friends to do videos. I meant to do this channel, start this channel up again back, or when I first started it, I was doing the Sword Art Online Integral Factor series. Now, the most viewed video on my channel is the Wedding Event Part 2. I don't know why, but that was back. I lost that account. That that series is done. The the Minecraft series, Minecraft Fun with me, or Hooded Pikachu, is done. I've lost most of my worlds and stuff. I still own my Wii U, which is what I recorded on back with uh, Minecraft Fun. I am going to pull up my channel and kind of discuss a little bit more on some of my other videos that I have in general. So, I do have a light in my face. I don't know how that's going to look either. But So, I have the rolling practice, some unboxing. This will, this will be called Unboxing 2. I wish I could call it 3, but I can't. Um, there's a little bit of Pokemon Mo Ultra Moon I see on my channel. That won't happen often, like, because that, I built something out of Lego for that stand, but it's gone now, and I wish I had it. So, just fixing this. So then, the memory defract, a little bit of gameplay, that was like a one-off. The Minecraft fun. I, if I remember correct, I did complete that world and do as much as I could before then um I lost I it doesn't have it it's like that's an older world I can't get it my Wii U doesn't have a gamepad so I can't use it to play games in the future I will try and get better quality videos out for gaming like Minecraft Sword Art games like Integral Factor my mic wasn't working for almost the entire thing I think or I just I don't remember if my mic wasn't working or I just chose not to use the mic but I don't feel comfortable with... This is really hard for me. This is the step I feel like I should make, though. Starting next year... I know I'm planning out a lot and saying a lot with this. But next year, videos will be scarce. I want to say by the... By fall of 2021. Because I'm going to be starting my college classes. As long as it's in class sessions. I'm not going to go too into that, but online cl all I'm going to say is online classes, not my thing. I have I struggled through high school. See, this channel started after I'm gra done with high school, so I have more time to dedicate to it. But the Bakugan content, I feel, is where my my place needs to be at the current moment. With I'm another rolling video coming out in November and October, because I'm going to do one next month, or during next month with... Games Life and Zekatron Gaming because they have Bakugan I haven't rolled on my channel yet. Like, um, Trox Ultra from last year, um, Cloptor Ultra from last year, and a couple others. Uh, the next rolling video will feature some of the new Bakugan that I have. So, like, Garganoid and Webum. I have to, I think I had, yes, I believe, yeah, I did have the. 
I'm not gonna check now, but I don't know if my video from yeah, okay, yes, I did have Cindy Scoparos, so I don't need to do that one. Next up with so like Garganoid Web um, and a couple others that I have gotten. So around the mid mid October, I will have a, another rolling video. I will try and do one every month. There is not one, the first one, for, and I'm not going to do it on the first like I did for September, which the one before that was June 25th, because this is also me trying to get better at rolling and to showcase the amount of Baku cores I have, which has gone up a little bit. Now, the thing I wish I did. Now, when I recorded for when last Wednesday, when I recorded the video with Nathaniel, which you guys will meet eventually, my family and fr my the rest of my friends know him. My family knows him. He's a good guy. He, he, me and him, when we recorded the rolling video from last week that didn't, or the unboxing video from last week that didn't get up, that got messed up, it didn't upload. The cycloid pack I had, the Baku, the one of the Baku cores was damaged. I will showcase a bit at the current moment, so I do need to move my camera in a different direction if I can get it right. So, you guys are kind of looking down a bit at the current moment. I just need to pull out the Baku core. Got it. It's, it does bug, it does see sadness to me that, that I have a damaged Baku core. It is the, a shield from the new year, from this year. I do not own another one of these, which, I mean, and this is two damage for play. It is a plus 150 shield. As you can kind of see, hopefully you guys can, there is damage uh, right here and right here. It is two damage for play, and it really saddens me. I opened, we noticed it after we, after we got in the car at Walmart, from Walmart. We noticed that the Baku cores weren't in place. I noticed the Baku cores weren't in place. And I'm like, alright, let's see if there's any damage. I noticed there's damage on that Baku core right away. And I'm really kind of sad about it because I don't own another one. And as you guys know, I mark my Baku cores that I don't that I don't have more than one of. I can't mark this one. My hope is that I can trade it with Nathaniel because I know he has another. Or two of it. So, this was kind of like... It was a lot more fun. It's a lot more fun to do these PSAs with someone else because they can like. It's a little bit of a questionnaire thing. In the future, with Games Life, we will be doing so. Hopefully, people will go to my Twitter, and follow me there, and leave kind of questions because I'm doing a Q&A at some point. I think I'm gonna get it recorded. I'll probably live stream on Twitch, which I will add. Which will probably most likely be added the day of this reco is recorded. So, I do have a Twitch account, go follow me there too, as long, and my Instagram, because on Twitter, on Twitch, I'll be streaming on Twitch, um, a Q&A, maybe, or some Bakugan gaming, coming up on the day this goes out, which this will go up, this is definitely going up earlier in the morning, because this doesn't require a lot of editing. There won't be, there will be background music for the start. There won't be during, a lot of this is like, I, just me thinking out loud. I know I'm boring. Like, I'm a very boring person, stuttering a lot. Like, I'm working myself out, but I need time. So during this, while I'm, like, while the channel's starting up, it's a lot of time for me to figure out, making sure I'm doing what I know, know what I want to do. Because... I've tried working at other places, it's, I feel like YouTube's where I should be, for content based. And if, uh, in a year, my channel's big enough, I, the uploads may stay the way they are, and I might not go to college, but I think college is the right play. I'm not gonna get into why, but, kind of, this is, the video's gonna, like, slow down from here and go dead, but, I hope everyone's going to enjoy the first part of this. And I hope people do stick around to the, zen, to the end, because I do care about COVID-19. I do care about what's going on in the world. It may not look it, but after Game 4, Game 4 is the last game that's going to not require masks, because I have it pre-recorded in general, because I need to have them done a week in advance. 
but I'm seeing that on my channel as well. The tournament game one has the most views out of my Bakugan content. And then it's me, game, or my first game against Games Life on the channel. Now, the rest of the games for that, I think, are gone. Or I still have game two. But I think game two is probably going to end up on my channel. It's going to be funny, because actually, the last bit of the video got cut out when my recording device stopped, which let me double check. Alright, still recording, so let's hope you guys all can see my face, but... Hope you guys liked me unboxing the Pyrus Darkest Clip. I will have more unboxing content soon when I get product in as long as it comes in through the mail. Because from now on I think I'm just going to order stuff in the mail. Because then when it gets here I can just mark out the addresses and all that and my name. Because I don't like my name on my channel. I Because I don't feel comfortable with people on the internet knowing my real name. My Facebook has my name and stuff. That's about it. My... I'm trying to get the rest of the people I'm recording with to call me by HP or Hooded Pikachu. I prefer HP just because or even like my alias Aaron, aka Ron. The jokes are there from that if you guys want to make them in the comments. But I'm trying my best at this. YouTube is not easy, especially with a smaller channel. You don't get big that quick. So I know I'm putting a lot of effort into this, but I care. It shows I care when I'm putting effort into doing something. If I don't put the effort in, it shows I don't care and I don't really want to do it. I am putting my best, my all in this. I'm doing what I can and it shows, it sort of shows when the videos go out and what they look like. The videos will be in a little bit better quality. I have a deck list coming up the following Wednesday after this one. This goes up. So, I think the 30th is the next Wednesday. So let me look at a calendar. Alright, so the 30th is a Wednesday, so October 7th will be the next um, deckless profile video. It is a f deck that's still being worked on, but I like it. It's pretty okay. Um, give me ideas for content in the comments, because I like Bakugan related content or even just stuff I can do just like say hey this is something I want to share um the limit is that I cannot record me playing the OG Bakugan game I have tried to do that that did not go well because it's a long game unless I live stream it on Twitch which I'm going to I'd rather play game get, um because I don't have money coming in, I will eventually. Starting in 2021, for sure, I will have money coming in. But right now, most of the product I have are scarce. Like, well, unboxings are going to be scarce at the start of this channel. With the start of this channel. Like, I have the Orlis Treno. I will be going over the rep, the Shields of Destroya, Orlis, Pyrus, Darkest deck at some point in the future. I will hopefully get it recorded this coming, the Wednesday that this goes up, but, and then some have some Legacy, I do have decks for Legacy built out, and they're pretty cool, you know, without a Doom card though, I don't own the Doom card anymore, it's a sad shame, but I gotta kinda end this, cause this is getting way too long and ranting, but, if you stay to the end, great job, kinda post in the comments, Bakugan Brawl, because I'm trying to, I'm gonna try and do something that different. Like say, hey, put this in the comments if you made it to the end. So today's is Bakugan Brawl. So I hope everyone enjoyed. And this was a kind of long video. I think the longest video is actually going to be this one, or close to it, because most of my SAO content was 20 minutes. So this will be the longest video, I think, running on my channel at 29, or almost 30 minutes. So, hope everyone enjoyed. Have a nice day. Ready, Pikachu?